G'day, g'day, g'day. So, week two, day six, I think, of quarantine and lockdown. God, it's a bit dark, isn't it? There we go. Stuff's happening. Um, so yeah, still locked down, still going around, but um, this is episode four. Spamisode four, shall we call it. Uh, in the four-part spam series, uh, so yeah, it is that. But you can't do episode four of a spam series without having some sake. Come by. Hmm. Will be revealed soon. How you doing? Welcome, welcome to Spamisode Four of our Spam series. Spam. Today we're going to be finishing off the uh, gift that keeps on giving, the can of Spam. We have a quarter of a cap uh, of a cap. Can, tin, package, a quarter of a package left, and we are going to do something special with this last quarter. We are going to make Spam Sushi. Specifically, um, a Spam, I don't know how to pronounce it, uh, mas, mas, Masubi, Masubi, Masubi I think it is called. Spam Masubi, which strangely enough is a very, very popular snack in Hawaii. Fact. So, to make Spam Masubi, we need a few things. We need Spam, and then we also need some rice. So I cooked some rice earlier on, and uh, I added a bit of, uh, after it was cooked, a bit of Sushi seasoning uh, in here, which this is, it's got stuff in it and it's like a vinegar, it's cool. Um, so that's awesome. So I put that in there to make sushi rice and I put that to the side for a little bit. And then you need your bit of spam. Um, insert clip here of me trying to get the spam out earlier on. So I got it out, so that's cool. So then what I did is I got the rice that I made and put it in there as I, that was set to the side. I got the spam can and I got the, uh, some thigh wrap and I put the thigh wrap inside and then I put the rice inside it and then I stamped it down and then put it in the fridge just over there. And then, so I put some rice in here and the wrap so then I can just go Rice. So, got my rice, got my spam. Now, all we need to do is basically make a thing for it. I don't even know what it's called. What's it called? A glaze. So, we're going to get a pan going. So, Get that hot. We're gonna get our cool. We'll cut that in half. To create two eighths of spam. All right? To the pan. pan we are going to add an eighth of a cup of sugar we're going to add an eighth of a cup of soy sauce or tamari sauce from what I've got here 
And then we're going to add an eighth of a cup of mirin or like rice wine vinegar or something of that nature. If you don't have that, use white wine vinegar, white vinegar, whatever. We're going to stir that up because we want basically all that sugar to be dissolved. Once it's all nice and bubbly, we're just going to drop our spam right in there. Alright, once our spam is basically nice and pan fried in this beautiful gooey ooey mixture of ours here, we're basically going to set that aside and I'll let those pieces cool. Alright. So once basically the meat is cool and you've got your little rice bomb out, we're going to take this out of its little package, stick that down there. What we're going to do is we're going to cut it in half. Now always want a wet knife to be able to cut in half, saves it from Flaking. Oh, not perfect, but it'll do. Now that we've got our rice and we've got our meats, we just need to add them together. Put that on top of that, now on top of that. We've got some little nori strips here, which I've cut in half. Got me a little brush, a bit of water, painty paint paint, paint paint paint. paint. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Spam Sushi. Mm. So, that was part four or four in the Spam series. I uh, hope you enjoyed that. Um, so I'll uh, have to try and come up with some other strange thing to do next. So, uh, yeah. See you then.